some people, I think this is another one of the easier things to refute, but this comes up probably as often as any of these other arguments, if not more. God, they would say, is the greatest aborter uh, in human history because 20 to 50 percent of embryos and fetuses do not survive throughout all of pregnancy. A bunch are, are miscarried. Some are miscarried so young that no one even, mm-hmm. the woman doesn't even know she's pregnant. So God has aborted basically all these babies. And clearly, I mean, you, that, you can't say that these are full human beings because we don't have funerals for them, usually after miscarriages, and, and, and it goes on and on and on. How do, you, how do you respond? Well, if dying early rather than later means you're a non-human, what do we do with, with, uh, with children? This already in, sounds dumb. It just already as yeah. soon as you go. I mean, how, what do we do with children in third world countries that live only a few weeks after birth? Hmm. There are some provinces of India and Pakistan where children die by uh, in incredible numbers before they reach the first month after hmm. birth. Does it follow those children are not human because they die sooner rather than later? But here, let's go back to the key point here. We always want to ask the question, how does this objection establish a right? to elective abortion as a fundamental right. Right. So we're going to see another non sequitur here. So let's look at it. How does the fact that nature, or let's say God, accidentally causes or directly causes the death of an unborn human being that we may therefore deliberately kill an unborn human being? That's always what we need to be asking here before we do anything else. And clearly it doesn't follow. As we said a moment ago, in third world countries, many children don't make it till their first month out of the womb. It doesn't follow we may go slit the throats of all children before they're uh, 30 days old. Right. Um, let's look at nursing homes. Hmm. The vast majority of nursing homes contain people who will never make it out of there alive. Hmm. Uh, does it mean we can deliberately kill them just because there's a high mortality rate in nursing homes? Natural disasters. Just Natural because Hurricane disasters. Katrina happened doesn't mean we've got the right to nuke cities. Well, what about that? Uh, where was that tsunami at? In Indonesia? Was Japan. That, um, well, there was another one in, oh. in Indonesia or somewhere where it killed hundreds of thousands of people. They don't right. even know how many. Right. Does it follow because nature kills people? We may deliberately do so.